Every week there will be two quests available at the Dragon Scale Expedition Camp, which are obtained from various posters located there. The quests typically involve killing an elite enemy, but can also include dungeon quests. At Renown Rank 6, you will gain access to the Expedition Supply Kit and be able to unlock the Cartographer's Flag. There are 20 locations throughout the Dragon Isles where you can plant a banner to receive 250 reputation, which is enough reputation for two full renowned ranks. These banners can only be planted once per character. The coordinates for all 20 banner locations are in the description below. At Renown Rank 2, you will be able to open Expedition Scout Packs and they will begin to appear on your minimap. At Renown Rank 5, you will unlock Buried Treasure which allows you to loot disturbed dirt piles. If you have a shovel in your inventory, blacksmiths will also be able to purchase the plans to craft sturdy Expedition shovels. Disturbed Dirt will show up as a treasure chest on your minimap. There will be a Dragon Isle artifact in every Disturbed Dirt that can be turned in for reputation. At Renown Rank 6, the Rock Climbing World Quests will be unlocked, which are a sort of mini game where you click from handhold to handhold while collecting items and dodging hazards. At Renown Rank 8, the Catalog World Quests unlock, which are another sort of mini game where you float down the river and snap pictures of wildlife in the area. At Renown Rank 16, you'll be able to loot Magic Bound Chests, which will contain similar items as the Expedition Packs and Disturbed Dirts. The expedition packs, dirts, and chests offer a way to grind Dragon Scale Expedition reputation if you are in a hurry. The Dragon Scale Expedition has additional quest lines that can be unlocked at ranks 13 and 24 and can be completed for additional reputation. Number 1. While doing world quests, be sure to have a rank 3 contract active to get 15 rep per world quest for the faction you choose. I would recommend an artisan consortium contract since they have the least number of ways to gain rep each week. Number 2. It's a good idea to always carry shovels so you can loot the disturbed dirts you come across. Sturdy expedition shovels are made by blacksmiths and can be bought from the auction house and small expedition shovels can be bought from the Dragon Scale Expedition rep vendor at Renown Rank 5. Number 3. Check your calendar to see if the Dark Moon Fair is active. If it is, then it's worth considering heading there for the 10% rep buff from the carousel. Number 4. Every week there will be two dungeon quests available in Veldraken and can be completed for 250 rep for the faction of your choice. Finally, the weekly Aiding the Accord quest will give 500 rep for each faction. If you already have a character at Renown level 10 or 20, then you'll be able to take advantage of the word of a worthy ally buff which will show up in your character's buff bar. If you're interested in reputation guides for other Dragonflight factions, check out these videos. Thanks for watching and any likes and subscribes are greatly appreciated. Have a great day.